My pleasure to invite Patu Shri Dutta, our guest curator for today. And he's reading two films today, 1969 film called Thoughts in a New Time by Sukhdev. And um, celebrated Canadian filmmaker, Guy Magnus film, My Young Day. And Madhu will introduce both the films. We'll watch them back to back and we'll have a discussion and Q&A afterwards. Thanks. As we were waiting outside, there some friends who were lamenting uh, the thin attendance. But I think the kind of people, the kind of filmmakers, both should be them, Guy uh, Madhim, are, uh, they wouldn't have lamented it. They, they're okay. They, they made very special films for people who want to engage it. They, I mean, they were not the people who are not blockbuster filmmakers. Though Sukhdev is now being termed as blockbuster filmmakers. <laughs> So here we are to watch 69 films by our legendary filmmaker is Sukhdev, uh, Thoughts in a Museum. Sukhdev, as you all know, was a diehard nationalist. And this film is that. Sukhdev nationalism went to the extent of some scholars calling him pro Congress. Uh, which have been debated, I mean, that's, that's not the place we are debating, but it's good to remember that because this film is made after Nehru's demise on occasion of Nehru's residence being turned into the uh, Nehru Memorial Museum. He had to work on old images of Nehru because he's, he's making the film after demise. So they, obviously he had access to all the earlier films and the, those footage. But they only came here, so they are not really archival in, archival in its look. And he had states, Gandhi and others. So the genius of, I mean, I would say the political um, filmmaker that Sudev was and the cinematic genius that Sudev was, actually they fight each other in this film. I'll just give you one example. I mean, the way he uses the still, suddenly the mundane official documentary making images just uh, fall off the screen. The, the, the stillness of the stills bring a certain kind of the personal loss and introspection that he was feeling. So, when the voiceover is very official. So there is a contradiction between the voiceover and the image. Another image I remember very well is that uh, we're talking about China War, Indochina War of 66. And um, the audio track is playing incessant um, sound of machine gun fire. And what we see is Nehru's bookshelf, the camera, while they are handheld camera, times left and right, left and right, left and right, friends. And thank God there is no also at that moment. I think this is the time a government official and a filmmaker are um, contesting each other. So that's very wonderful. And as you know, Shukri was a brooding filmmaker, not a tambour filmmaker like Almadi. Long years ago, we made a trip with destiny, and now the time comes when we shall redeem our place, not only all in full measure, but very substantially. At the stroke of the midnight hour, when the world sleeps, India will awake to life and freedom. हमारे मुल्क ने बहुत कुछ किया, बहुत कुछ हमने दुनिया दे डाली अपने मुल्क के आइंदा It is a voice we have often heard, a voice that captures the thoughts and moods of a whole people, the voice of Jawaharlal Nehru. It is the voice of a man that has found an echo in the hearts of the Indian people, a voice ever guiding and inspiring them to newer and greater heights of progress and enlightenment towards a new India that is now in the making. And upon him, the Indian people have bestowed their love and affection.